Hi there, it's Ben here from Accurix. Today I'll be giving a quick demonstration of the COVID-19 triaging questionnaire. It's completely free and it's available to all EMIS and System 1 practices. If you've got any questions, I'll put a link to our support chat in the description below, and I'll also keep that description up to date with FAQs as they come in. To those of you unfamiliar with Accurix, Accurix is this little green toolbar that hovers over EMIS and System 1. And if we click on this message icon here, the patient's name, details, and mobile number are brought in automatically. To send a questionnaire, we go into this Flory tab, and then we can choose the COVID-19 triaging questionnaire. Now, when we click send and save, this message is gonna to go to the patient's phone, and it'll save to the patient record automatically. Let's now change to the patient's mobile screen, and we can see what it looks like from their end. I'm on the patient's phone now, and the text has just come through. We can see that a unique link has been generated at the end of the message. And if we follow that, we'll be asked some questions. So we'll be happy to proceed. Yes. We'll need to put in the dummy patient's date of birth here. And now it's asking us the questions. Have you traveled outside of the UK in the past 14 days? And then we click yes, it asks where? Let's say Paris, France. Has someone who has tested positive of coronavirus been in close contact with you? Do you have any of the following? Cough, fever, or shortness of breath? That's it, and then we can submit there. Thank you for completing your GP's questions. Your practice will review this and let you know what to do next. We can see that a confirmation text has also come through automatically that says, if you answered yes to any of the questions in the questionnaire, and are considered at risk of coronavirus, the surgery will contact you on this number. If you answered no to all questions, please attend your appointment as booked. If any responses change between now and the appointment, please contact the surgery by phone. Let's now change back to uh, the patient record and see what it looks like when the response comes in. We're back in the patient record and we can see that there's a little red one above my initials on the Accurix toolbar. This indicates that a response has come through. If I click on my initials and then follow that one to the COVID-19 team, we can see that the response has come in here. We've then got the option to save it to the record. And if we click on that and then reload the consultation screen, we'll see that the patient record has updated automatically with the response.